So I asked a question in my YouTube community and most people responded that they wanted to see more remote jobs, which is understandable. More and more people are moving towards a remote first work culture wherein you're able to do absolutely anything that you want to do and know that you are working from the comfort of your space. And many companies are moving towards a remote first culture because it enables them to find talent worldwide and not just in that country that they usually do business. So I dug a little deeper and here is a company that is hiring for multiple positions and they are hiring worldwide. Jamaicans, wanna hear what me say? They are hiring worldwide. <laughs> Hello guys, welcome and welcome back to your girl's channel. It's a girl Lika. So on this channel, I make a lot of content regarding making money online as well as side hustles that you can do no matter where you are in the world. So if that is the kind of content that you want to see, please go ahead, subscribe. Yeah. I also want to mention that I have a blog and I have been posting content on it that you might not see on here and the reason for that is because me can't be two places at once. I can't be in two places at once. So you can always check my blog if you don't see something here and the name of my blog is thinksuccess1.com blogspot.com i will leave a link in the comment section or the description box to it now for this company the salary and the experience varies based on the position that you are applying for to get started you need your laptop camera strong internet connection and your headset of course so the company that we're talking about it is called community phone and they have a remote first culture which means they hire globally and then other places but globally. So the positions that I'm recommending you guys to apply for and if these are not of interest to you, please go ahead and apply to the ones that you feel best to apply for. So the first one is your customer service position and you need at least four years experience and that one pays $1,040 per month. Now, if you have the four years experience that they are asking for, when you are applying, they are going to ask you for the customer relationship management software that you are um, used to using, basically. So that includes like Zendesk, Freshdesk, HubSpot. I'm going to put a list somewhere on the screen so that you guys can see the different types of CRM software out there that you might not have on the tip of your head so that you can include it on the application form. The next thing is that you're going to need to do a 30 second screencast or screen recording of their home page and you're going to need to leave that link on the application form. Now for the screencast, what you're basically going to do is that you're going to download a software called Loom. When you are recording, let me give you a few tips, right? You basically need to explain to them what their website or what their company is all about in 30 seconds. Yeah. Now, what I recommend you doing is that you can actually go through the website first and then you make a few notes on what you noticed it is about don't put it in a way as if you are writing an essay so i'm reading here this company this company offers xyz services they were involved in this i'm pretending that i'm reading off a website all right i'm going to just speak like that as if you know i was just explaining what the company is about now if you might have a problem with speaking this out loud what you can do is to pre-write it so you write it before and let me get my computer on your computer okay, so this is their website you might not be able to see so here's a camera here oops here is a camera right here right so what you want to do is you want to put the sticky pad or so that you wrote the information on and place it for example over here on the screen or right here underneath the camera or here you know you can put it anywhere so 
for example, you are scrolling now, you know, you are reading the information that you have on the sticky pad. You are reading it, but you are pretending as if you are looking at the website at that time and reading based on what you see on the website. But in truth and in fact, you already had the information written down and pasted on the screen. So, for example, you put some information you noticed on the first part of the website you, wrote, you write it down over here so when you are there you read it you scroll up you had some information written about that part you read it when you read there and you do that going down and it is 30 seconds so you don't need a lot of you don't need a lot of things just keep that in mind and guys just a small reminder remember your whole presentation they are taking all of that into consideration so ensure that your background looks nice not like mine <laughs> not like mine with everything everywhere so ensure that your background looks presentable ensure that you are wearing an appropriate top so you know like formal work and if you have your headset put it on even if it's not even on just put it on for you to look a little bit more formal and they're asking you a question about if the customer is always right now guys yes the customer is always right because the customer makes or breaks the business now regarding your resume no guys you need to practice to have detailed resumes so for each position that you've worked over the course of your lifetime or if it is that you only want to include the positions that are related to the position that you are applying for now what you want to do is when you state that position and the company that you worked for you want to give a list of the functions that you carry out now you don't need to have a lot of things but you need to give them a little understanding of what you are capable of doing now when it comes down to your skills you need to have skills that are relatable so um on the website you can just scroll through and to see you know a little bit of what is what it is that they are seeking and you need to just put back that on your resume or you know you can google something again so the skills of a remote customer service representative copy a little bit of those and write it along with your technical skills now the second role that i'd advise you to apply for is their chat sales representative role now for this role they pay 1000 us dollars base plus commission and you need to have four years experience working in sales now when you are submitting your resume for this position guys please this is sales ensure that you include the quotas that you have actually completed um, when you were working for a certain company or so when it comes to skills ensure that you put things like generate leads product knowledge closing sales lead nurturing you know stuff like that along with other technical skills now when they ask you what do you like about sales you could speak about things like i like the fact that sales allows you to meet a lot of people over the course of your career and to possibly build long-standing relationships with these customers or you know you can speak about the fact that in sales it's a lot of personal development so you know you get the opportunity to read a lot of sales development books and that helps in both your professional and personal career and you know the books that you have read they have increased your ability to sell things tremendously and to basically win people over now the third position is their sales representative position so the previous was chat sales this one is just sales and you get to earn 1600 us dollars base pay plus uncapped commission yes no you need to have at least seven years experience working in sales guys i think um as somebody from a third world country you know 1600 could do quite a lot and that is just the base i think that could do a lot for me 
Now regarding your resume, remember it needs to be detailed. So you know, explain what you need to explain and list the necessary information that you need to list. And guys, trust me, this is not the first time that I've come across this company. Now I did come across them a few um, months ago, but by the time I was supposed to put information together and all of that, the position expired. So guys, please, the minute you see this video, please go ahead and apply. And this is just one of the companies that I've come across. Now guys, if you want to see more companies like this, please go ahead and subscribe. Turn on your post notification bell so you know when I post next time. Until then, bye!